guys, how's it going? It's Teely here. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys another haul. This time it is Hobby Lobby and I did ask you guys on my social media, which is Snapchat, Instagram, Facebook, and Twitter. And I got a lot of votes for yes. Some people said no, but I'm assuming they're not crafters. But that's an assumption. But today, yes, I'm showing you guys my haul. And without further ado, let's get into this video. Okay, so the first thing that I did was I went to the Christmas section and I got some ornaments. And coincidentally, these ornaments match my shirt. But this is going to be for an ornament wreath. I've never made one myself, so I'm really, really excited to do that. And this has like a shiny gray, like a dullish grayish bronze, um, a pink, white, sparkly silver, and it's just all really, really cute. Like I love all of these colors. And I didn't want to go traditional because I always try to go traditional, but I thought I would step a little bit outside of my comfort zone to be able to do this. And woo! All right, so the next thing is some deco mesh now this is big and I have not decided if I still buy a bigger reform yet but we're gonna find out and so that you guys know everything right now at Hobby Lobby like I think all Halloween Christmas and fall stuff is 40% off no this is not sponsored I'm just letting you guys know so you guys can go 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 and go snatch everything up before they quit the sale um, so everything that I got was on sale and I did save $80 for everything that I bought here. The next deco mesh that I got was this black and white striped deco mesh and I thought this would be really nice for Halloween. It reminds me of spider webs. Next I got this really pretty, it's like a neutral metallic deco mesh and I thought this would be really pretty for fall. It was in the Christmas section but I'm like... That looks fall. It's so pretty though. I really, I love the colors in that. Next up is smaller versions of gold. This is a darker gold than the big one that I just showed. And I really like the fact that these have that metallic inside of it just because that adds that extra little flair and pop to my crafting. This is different. Um, this is a Poly Pro mesh ribbon that is weatherproof. Um, to me, personally, it looks like a burlap deco mesh. I'm pretty sure that's basically what this is. Uh, I've never heard this before. I've never seen it before. I've never used it before, so this is going to be interesting. And you guys just had to know that there was going to be Halloween colors. So, to start off, I have two Halloween oranges, two Halloween greens, two blacks, and one purple. This was the last dark purple. I was like, are you serious? serious right now it's killing my vibe so the purple is going to be an accent for whichever wreath I decide to use this on next up there was this really pretty um fall garland and it's like a bunch of leaves and the orange I love the orange on this like it is so pretty so disclaimer the section in Hobby Lobby where it's all of like the glittery and shiny accents and decorations for your wreaths or for any craft that you do is just magical to me. It is just magical. It's It makes me so happy to go down that aisle. Normally I'm not like that in Hobby Lobby, but at Christmas I have to be. I love Christmas for so many reasons. So to start off, I got this cute little bunch. It has a present on it, a little drum. Gold pine cones, golden ferns, and some other foliage. And I just thought this was super cute. And what I liked about the stuff from Hobby Lobby is that it comes with the floral wire already on it. So that makes my life a little bit easier. And then my mom actually pointed these out. This is what it looks like in a store. But when you open it up, this is what it looks like. My mom actually showed me these. And I thought that it was just beautiful. I told her, I was like, all right, throw them in the cart. Throw them right here because those were just too pretty to pass up. Next I have another little bunch. Just this one has more gold sparkly ferns. There's a little star in here. There's some ornaments and then a bunch of foliage. To go with the ornaments because I am making ornament wreath, I thought that I would get a little bit of a centerpiece. So this is going to be the centerpiece for that also matching my shirt. So yeah, that's going to be so pretty. And next, I have been waiting to make something with one of these. And it is 
the popcorn and berry string and it's still going and going and going and going and going so yeah this is going to be going on the wreath with this large deco mesh and I did get some velvet ribbon which you guys are going to be seeing here in a few minutes they had this really cool Halloween ribbon I was like what so it is just regular ribbon but it's like it's got diamonds on it and it has all the Halloween colors I was like dude this just saved me time I love I love how that looks it's glittery it has all the colors it's ribbon it's perfect next in the in the fall section they have more burlap and I've actually never used burlap that I'm aware of so I got some regular colored burlap and I got some more burlap but in this more rusty kind of fall color and I I love this I actually have a cardigan that's this exact color I got some I got some Christmas velvet ribbons, specific Christmas velvet ribbon. Okay, you guys, so that is everything that I got in my Hobby Lobby haul. And if you love Hobby Lobby, don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up so I know that you are enjoying these kinds of videos because I am. I really love going to Hobby Lobby during this time of year. And if you guys do any projects that are fall related or if you're making wreaths for the holidays or anything like that so I can see it, don't forget to use the hashtag FallingWithBug so I will see everything that you guys post. It's cliche. I know I say this every video. I'm not even going to finish it because I say it so much. Hit that big red subscribe button down below so you will always be notified when I upload a new video and to ensure even more that you get that you get notified when I upload a new video don't forget to double wet the notification bell so you will never miss a video from me because of the YouTube algorithm because my videos don't get a lot of views when they're posted and you know there are subscribers that I have and we're almost to 70 we're almost to 70 you guys and you guys will not all get the notification because if you don't hit the notification bell there's nothing I can really do and I will just sit here and be sad because you guys won't get notified so please hit that notification bell and i will see you guys in my next video bye Mwah.